Knock, knock. Oh, Brooke. Come in. I'm just uh, finishing up. Okie dokie. Oh, this is... This is really great. Well, thank you. That's exactly why I asked you to come up here. Ah, uh, I know. A makeover? Uh, no. Although that wouldn't be such a terrible idea. No, actually, I would like to ask you a favor, Brooke. I'd like Tempo to do an article on Amanda Dillon. The face of Fusion's new glamour line. Well, you know, Tempo is primarily hard news content. But I think I could find a place for an article on Amanda and your new line. Well, thank you. Mm -hmm. So I will have my people call your people and uh, we'll get it set up. Brooke, hmm. how was lunch? It was great to see Jack, you know? It was so lovely, so much to catch up on. Yes, I'm so glad that he moved back to Pine Valley. It certainly wasn't the same without him. No, I agree. So now that he's back, what exactly are your feelings for him? So much to do. Jack and I are friends. We're just very good friends. Best way to enjoy a divorce, don't you think? If that's all it is. We're just close. Like you and Adam. You know, Jack is such a great guy. I would hate to see his heart mowed down again. I'm not going to hurt him. Well, sometimes you just can't help yourself. If you care about him at all, do him a favor. And what, leave him alone? <gasps> Brooke, it's very dear of you to be so concerned. And I'm sure if either one of us ever needs your advice, we'll ask. Okay. Knock, knock. Come on in. Pardon the mess. Uh, why don't you have a sit? Well, <laughs> never mind. Um, <laughs> hey, I talked to your contractor. Uh, do you mind if I keep unpacking while no, we chat no, about no. that? No, no, no. Not at all. Not right. at all. He says that if you'll cover his prep costs, you can get most of your deposit back. Oh, fantastic. Oh, you are great. Thank you. Thank you for taking care of that so quickly. I'm not exactly burdened by clients. Yet. Anyway. When I call this guy back, the deal's going to be done, so if you're having any second thoughts, dear, you better tell me to hold off. Yeah, I know. You know, I really was sort of looking forward to sinking my teeth into a career that I could be passionate about. But I know that letting go of this whole candy store idea is the right thing to do. You're separating the civil law books from the criminal law books. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> no, that's okay. And the case books from the procedurals? Uh-huh. Well, that tells my finely tuned deductive mind that you've done this before. Yes, I did work for an attorney for a while. Really? Uh-huh. Doing what? Paralegal. Paralegal. How do you get along with computers? All you have to do is talk about your experience. I certainly didn't expect to walk out of here with a job. Well, indeed, I didn't expect the answer to my problem to come walking in. <laughs> <laughs> I would get you some references from my old bosses, but no it's been such a long time. Sure. And you know what? To tell you the truth, I think they were more interested in my legs than my brains. <laughs> Go figure. Well, you won't have that problem. Oh, yet. well, good. I promise. I just want to make sure. <laughs> All right, cut red, black, 